Each of you will read from one of Mad Mouth's hate-filled screeds so we can figure out who's been talking about us. Well, not us. I mean, yes, us, but the whole school in general. This isn't gonna help you. Mad Mouth disguises his voice. <laughs> I'm a trained musician. I have an ear for these things. Mad Mouth will be exposed. The administration is run by cowards and pigs who only care about money. CB and Laney are so annoying. Clearly, they're hot for each other. Just get busy already. Um, CB, which screed is this? I don't know. I had Miss Jensen's typing class transcribe it for me. The bickering, the teasing, the long, doe-eyed stares. And that's just CB. I really should have checked this first. The bump and grind. Get your freak on. Knockin' boot. Human pretzel, double dip. Oh, come on. Doesn't this guy talk about anything else? Whoever it is, just admit it. It's not us. Listen, he's on right now. As I speak, the lovebirds are looking for me, trying to shut me down. Oh, and we will. But they won't. You can't hide from us forever. Because I can hide forever. Damn, he's annoying, but good. Can we go now? Oh, sure. Sorry to falsely yeah. accuse you. Don't tell your parents about this. Have a great day. It is our fault. Tommy, tie your shoe. This is a nightmare. We'll never figure out who Mad Mouth is. Next up, some tunes from the world's greatest band, Rush. Um, or any band. Doesn't have to be Rush, but they are the greatest. Damn it! Son, Son of a dummy. bitch. Don't you worry, loyal listeners. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, no, it's the man. Atkins signing off. I mean, Mad Mouth. What the hell are you doing? I told you radio was my jam. I just... Liked feeling alive again. By telling everyone we have a thing going on? But you do have a thing going on. But we don't have a thing going on. Then why are you two bantering all the time and busting each other's balls? Because that's what friends do. Yeah. I mean, look at him with his dumb hair and his dumb ties. And I mean, who wears pants like that? Okay, well. Sometimes there are so many pleats, I don't even understand how there can be so many. Point is, we need to tell Glasscott about this. But I'll be fired. Well, frankly, you should be for turning on us the way you did. At least I didn't turn on the kids. What? We didn't turn on them. All we did was shut them down when we didn't like what they were saying. Oh. Look, part of my job is I get to be a fly on the wall, and I hear their problems. They don't think anybody cares what they have to say, and all you did was prove it was true. Well, your job isn't to speak for them. You know, I work just as hard as you do, and frankly, I actually respect these kids. Serious Johnny Atkins makes me sad.